Well, the vampires are definitely planning to ambush us. I'll have to reconsider what we should do next. Everyone shut up. Okay. We'll snipe and see how they react, just to test the waters. There are three targets inside, powerful nobles named Crowley, Useford, Chess Bell, and Horn Skull. If it looks like our enemies are too strong for us to defeat, we'll leave the hostages. We can't afford to lose any more troops, especially elites like you. That makes freeing the hostages a secondary concern. Moving forward, I'm gonna need all of you. Not exactly. The extermination of the nobles will have a huge impact on the war. But from now on, our mission is to keep the enemy distracted as long as we possibly can. Which is why... We're gonna see how they react to a little expert sniping. If they attack in force, we'll run. But if we see an opening, we'll try to save all of the hostages. Best case scenario, we'll kill the nobles too. Now you're dreaming. Things never go that well. Why are you always such a pessimist? Come on, Gurren, I'm just telling it like it is. Don't worry, I'm still gonna kill these guys. Okay, I've got the fourth floor. Focus your attention on the windows in the next level up. Then take the damn shot! Ordinarily, even a noble wouldn't have been able to dodge a shot like that. Which means... That this guy must be an extremely powerful vampire. It's no wonder nine of our strongest teams couldn't handle him. We don't stand a chance. I see. Then I highly doubt we could beat him by force alone. We've got two choices. We can shoot our comrades now before they're tortured, and then get the hell out of this town. We somehow manage to split up the nobles, then save the hostages and retreat. Naturally, that plan's more dangerous. I doubt we'd all survive. Yeah, I know. There's no way around it. We have to attack. We'll put on a big show so they think we're the main unit. I'm not against killing the bloodsuckers. But I don't see how we stand a chance with them waiting around for us like this. If they start to overwhelm us, we'll retreat. Come on. We should move locations. How does it look, Shinya? Our enemies aren't making any moves. But then, they're most likely waiting on us. Who knows what's inside, though? We're walking into this partially blind. Then why are you still standing here? What? <laughs> Sounds like Goshi's our first casualty. She on the way. Please promise that you'll do as I say. Uh, that guy's gonna be a problem. He's on a totally different level than the other nobles. I'm afraid this might be it for us. No way. Things are all going as I planned. <laughs> Who are you trying to kid, Gurren? At least we did a solid job of getting their attention. You and I make pretty good bait. You done resting? Because I'd kind of like to escape now. I don't want to be rude. Then I guess we have to stay here and keep the three of them entertained. Stop moving so much. You shouldn't take your eyes off of me! So how badly are you wounded, Shinya? It could be worse. I could have broken all my bones. If you're strong enough to joke, then walk on your own. You're not getting rid of me that easily. This way I can hold them off behind us. Are they coming? No. Maybe I managed to scare the bastards off with that last shot. Gurren! Don't you dare! We have to get out of here. Someone stop him! That's a direct order! They've got backup inbound. They're retreating right now! That's an order! Move! I heard you were screaming in your sleep again. So what kind of nightmare was it this time? It was just a dream. Go back to sleep. You're starting to be a real pain. Why don't I hang out in here until you fall asleep again? Would you like that? One day you'll feel better. I promise. I'm sure you'll know. Now go to sleep. You've got training tomorrow. <laughs>